So we have a small company, and there are four shareholders. Uh, one with 30% ownership, another with 25%, another with 25%, and one with 20%. And they're trying to decide whether to open a new location. Uh, and their bylaws state that more than 50% of the ownership has to approve any decision like this. So we're going to represent this with what's called a weighted voting system. The idea here is that we're there is a vote happening, but each person has a different weight or, or power in the, in the, or influence in the election. In this case, Mr. Smith has a larger say in the result than, uh, Mrs. Lee. And so, when we represent a weighted voting system, we do so with three pieces, uh, with several pieces. The first is called the quota. And the quota is the number of votes or weight of votes needed for a motion or a decision to pass. Uh, and then we list the weights of each of the players. And so these are the weights. And each weight corresponds to one person. So typically this will be the, the weight for, for player one. Uh, so in our particular election here, we have to decide how we're going to assign weights to people. Now, the easiest way to do that here is going to be to use the percentages. So we'll start with Mr. Smith as our first player here, and we'll give Mr. Smith 30 votes, or 30% of the vote. We're just going to pretend that it's 30 votes. Uh, Mr. Garcia then gets 25 votes, Mrs. Hughes 25 votes, and Mrs. Lee gets 20 votes. And uh, since the bylaws state that more than 50% of the ownership has to approve a decision like this, our quota will be 51 votes. Uh, it's one more than half because uh, we need more than 50%. Now, it, it, it's good to note that this quota value always has to be, uh, more than, more than half the votes. Because if it was, you know, exactly half or less than half of the votes, then half the, uh, half the voters could vote for it, half the voters could vote against it, and both of them is re both of them are reaching the quota. And it doesn't make sense to do that. Uh, and certainly, uh, it makes sense that, uh, the quota cannot be bigger than, uh, so it's less than or equal to, equal to, uh, the total number, total number, uh, of votes or total weights of the votes. Uh, in this case, it wouldn't make sense for the quota to be 101, uh, because there's no way that it could be reached even if everyone supported it. Uh, so in this case, this is the weighted voting system we need for this scenario.